Sky Para Market is a spin-off of the Do Re Mi Market Corner on the TV program Amazing Saturday. On both shows, guests listen to K-pop and try to write down the lyrics correctly for a chance to win prizes. On the second episode of CI Para Market, foreign TV personalities Tyler Rash, Sam Okia, Sayuri Fujita, and Robin Diana listen to winners every day and guess the lyrics to one of the verses. Your browser does not support video. When the four could not guess the last bits and pieces of the lyrics, they grew frustrated. Your browser does not support video. After discussing possibilities among themselves, the four decided on a word to fill the last blank. Ad choice as advertising in red invented by Teeds it wasn't until the actual lyrics were revealed and the four reacted with such shock the winner fans found the video uncomfortable. Your browser does not support video. Your browser does not support video. These guys have worse pronunciations than I do, Robin Diana your browser does not support video. They're really bad at pronunciations, Tyler Rash your browser does not support video. I can pronounce better. I can't believe it's O'Neill. Today, Sayuri Fujita your browser does not support video. I'm sorry, but can these guys sign up at a Korean language school? Sam Okia winner fans have grown furious at these comments. I hated listening to them talk. I wish I never watched this video. Well, how rude. I mean, I get you don't hear all the words. But telling them to go to a language school is. Or, you all can work on your hearing. Um, I'm sorry but I didn't understand a word these guys said either. I had to read the captions. Who do they think they are? How can you say y'all have better pronunciation than native Koreans? I've almost enjoyed the game part but the remarks at the end are very uncalled for. I admire you for learning a language aside from your own but please be mindful of the words coming from your mouth. Learning a thing or two about a language doesn't give you the right to criticize a native speaker. This isn't the first time CI Paramarket guests have mentioned pronunciations while listening to K-pop. Though, the show has covered various K-pop hit songs from artists like Winner and Twice, along with Momo Land and BTS, for an episode on TWICs, What Is Love, Sam Okia begged for clear pronunciations. Your browser does not support video. Twice, can you please pronounce the words clearly? Sam Okia, the viewers didn't think it's that big of a deal. They even agreed that some K-pop artists have questionable pronunciations and the whole struggle is relatable, foreigner or not. I'm Korean and I don't know what they're saying. Some idols do have bad pronunciations. LMAO. He told twice to pronounce words clearly. Unless you're interested in K-pop and know a lot about it, nothing they say would register. This is hilarious, especially because I can't hear a thing either. Lol, they're so cute. Here's the full video of the winner episode of CI Para Market. Korean government will soon allow men to do volunteer work in place of military service.